Hey guys, how's it going? Chez back again. Welcome to episode number 104 of the Twitch stream series here on the Chess Noy Gaming channel. If you're watching on YouTube uh, tomorrow, or today as you're viewing it, then feel free to skip forward uh, a few minutes to where we actually load the save up in the background and continue forward. As always, opening a few moments to spend just by me welcoming people in, etc. And, uh, and getting set up, which hopefully won't take too long because the little notification video is already on its way to sub boxes so we should be able to go live sooner rather than later I will just get a nightbot in though so uh, nightbot is here and available for us because no doubt I'll get 70 bajillion comments going Chaz where do you get your face pack from and your and your badges and your kits and stuff and then 10 minutes later Chaz what well, you know where do you get your face packs from and, and the badges and the kits and then you put the link in the chat and the same person will ask five minutes later Chess, where did you get the badges and the and the kits and the faces from? You're like, oh my god! Yes, I'm live. Hello. I did see Aguero miss the penalty. Yeah, I've got um, I've got City PSG on above me. I was out unfortunately when Ronaldo scored his two goals, so I missed. I missed seeing Ronaldo score the, uh, his two goals in two minutes. But I'm sure there'll be vines on uh, on Twitter somewhere that I can try and find. I'm sure there'll be vines on Twitter. Subscribington subscribed for 11 months in a row. Thank you very much, bro. I appreciate that. I'll drop you the sub pipe in the chat. That's very kind of you, bro. Thank you very much for the long-term support. Let me just tweet the stream out. Get going in just a sec. So you're going to be in? No, good header, well one. Did Aguero pick up a knock? He, he, he looked like he was limping towards the end of the first half. I don't know whether he picked up a knock or not. <laughs> You'll have to let me know in chat. Did Forrest win? No, Forrest lost 2-1 last night. Unfortunately for uh, Milky Bar Kid, who was there. Yeah, I'm, I'm a little bit gutted for Wolfsburg, really, getting that 2-0 lead in the first leg and playing ridiculously well to get it, and then two minutes in... Uh, the first half, and they concede two goals. That's a free kick. PSG got a free kick in a very dangerous position right now. <clears throat> Cavani got. Oh, I don't know. It's just a tangle of legs with Fernando, I think, more so than anything else. Manuel Pellegrini wasn't keen on the uh, the foul being given. You could tell. Hey, Josh. Your baseball practice got cancelled. Well, it's good to have you back with us, bro. Let's get cracking, shall we? Because we've got a game first before um, before we get to the January transfer window. We have a game on deadline on deadline day on um, New Year's Day, so we'll play that first before we do any transfer stuff, just to get it done and out of the way. And then we'll jump into the yeah. Eber's about to take the free kick. Oh, he hit that fucking hard. That's a brilliant save by Joe Hart, by the way. Oh no, the game is on the 30th. I swear there was a game on New Year's Day. Oh no, it got moved, didn't it? Because of the Cup at One Cup and the FA Cup. Okay, well, we, <laughs> in the previous stream, we went on a amazing run of form and then lost. And the stream before that, we went on a great run of form and then lost. So I'm hoping to go on a great run of form and then not lose. That's the plan, although I don't know how many games will get played today uh, because uh, we're going to be doing a lot of transfer stuff. A lot of transfer stuff, yes. Uh, yeah, you can go out on loan tour. Uh, my lights haven't changed. The light placement has changed. 
I moved my setup around a little. Well, I say I moved it around a little bit. I moved it to the right. <laughs> I moved a gesture drawers that was in the way, and I've now moved my desk right into the corner, so I can have the green screen up at all times, and I don't have to climb over my bed to get out of my room when the green screen's up. So I can just get up and walk off now, rather than having to climb over my bed all the time, which is nice. Another good game for Groit. Although, unfortunately, only a 2 2 draw against the Zetian. You have progress exams. What are progress exams? Just like mid year exams. No, it's not even mid year exams, is it? Because we're in April. What are progress exams? Just like end of year exams, Embo. Is that what you mean? Luis Garcia excited about... Oh, thanks, mate. It's assistant manager at Logarones. Wasn't he manager somewhere? Oh, no. Just player. Just a player. Uh, West Ham result will drive us on to do better. Um... No attention. Yeah. No... Danny Ings might be coming back soon, though, so that's good. I've still got a couple of things I need to add to my setup, and then I'll do a setup video. Pizarro. Guido Pizarro. Hey, Guido. Hey, no thanks. Uh, apparently, Joe Langston is going to be incredible. I don't know though, I don't know though. I will just trigger extensions for them all, why not? And the other ones I don't care about because they're just not going to be any good. So many games in January though, we've got a game every like four days in January. Like, literally. Four days game, three days game, four days game, three days game, four days game, three days game throughout the entire month. We are 4th though, Bournemouth are 13th, and a win would put us within one point of Arsenal and Tottenham, although Tottenham probably play today and could uh, pull away again. Oh well, that's that bottle of Ribena gone already. I would very much like to bounce back from the defeat against West Ham. Sacco suspended, so we'll put... Squirtle in. Chaka, Matweedy, Lacazette on the right, Astori at Cam, Yami on the. no, Yami on the left, and Studge. Good old Studge up top. Is Yami better at something else? No, he's just exactly the same, fair enough. Fair enough, like. Uh, I don't know, Foxy. I think it came up the other day. I think the notification came in the chat the other day, Foxy, like about four or five days ago. I remember it coming up, so I don't, it probably won't do it again. I was probably live at the time that your subscription went through, so it did the notification. And now, unfortunately, it won't do it for a second time. Jordan Henderson is Ibe back. All oh, Jordan Ibe's back. Jordan Ibe's back. Firmino's been in good form as well, actually. Hmm. Then rather than Ibe, I'll put Origi. Because he could play out wide or at striker. I don't want to risk Danny, Danny Ings yet. We'll play Danny Ings against Exeter in the FA Cup at the end of the week. If we get that far. Duh. There's no, I would donate, but I'm skint. It's cool, man. There's no, there's no necessity to uh, to donate. Uh, go out there and put on a worthy display. Turn that up a little bit. I'm beating in your Cambridge save. Go on, Sam. Keep going, keep going.
Yeah, Flanagan can play on both sides. Jeeps, that was nearly a horrible start. You'll donate next Tuesday. You'll <laughs> donate the exact price of a Cambridge United main stand home ticket. <laughs> No, there's never any there's never any pressure to donate. It's all voluntary. I did this before I set up donations and I'll do it after donations stop being a thing. But Sturridge could have given us a one nil lead there, but unfortunately he didn't. Disallowed girl. Do you mean goal macker? <laughs> Disallowed girl. No three miles allowed. <laughs> That was all I correct, yeah, I thought it might have been. Uh, Cambridge got Morecambe next Tuesday. It's going to be my first... My first Cambridge United home game for four years. So I'm pretty hyped about going back, to be honest. I'm going to be sat in the main stand, though, so I'm sat down. I'm not having to stand up, obviously having to take my health into consideration. Although I probably will go around to the terraces at half-time to go and see everyone. Spend 15 minutes hugging people I haven't seen for four years. And then, oh, Yarmolenko, I'd hug him right now. What a screamer. And then go back and sit with Danny again. Uh, I don't live in Cambridge, no. I live uh, about 15 minutes outside Cambridge. I will be vlogging it, though, yeah. I will be vlogging it and putting it up on the channel at some point in the near future. Let's see. We're going to Blue Water on the Monday with my sister, shopping. So I'm going to be pretty dead anyway, but I promised Danny I would make a, I would make a game before the end of the season. And considering my sleep schedule doesn't necessarily lend itself towards Saturday afternoon kickoffs right now, I'm going to make the final home evening game of the year. So I made a promise to Danny that I'd make one before the end of the season. I would like to start going back to football on at Cambridge and at Chelsea next season. I'm but I'm not I'm gonna see how I get on Tuesday first. I may even I may even at um at Blue Water hire one of those um mobility scooters. So I don't have to do so much walking. Bury that. Yes. Lacazette 2-0. Bournemouth have been good in this. It's only because Timo Horns made another couple of really good one-on-one -on -one saves. Hey, everyone. Thank you very much for the donation. I'll check it. It's £4 from Foxy369. It says, well, I will get my shout out one way or another. Anyway, as Man City are the only English team left, are you supporting them to win it? As I feel we should support those flying the English flag. Um, firstly, shout out to Foxy for the donation. And thank you very much. And apologies you missed your subscription renewal. Uh, with regards to English teams in the Champo League. I could pretty much guarantee... Hang on. PSC might be scoring. No. Pretty much guarantee you that um, if it were Chelsea the only, were the only side left... In the Champions League, City fans wouldn't be rooting for Chelsea. So, no, I'm not necessarily rooting for City, nor would I root for Arsenal or Man United or Liverpool. They wouldn't root for Chelsea, so I won't root for them. I don't... I, to be fair, I don't really care who goes through from PSG City, to be honest. Because City are not... Sorry, PSG have knocked us out of the Champions League the past two years, so I'm not exactly too keen on the sight of them right now. No. Good goal, but Kachimga should never have been allowed that opportunity in the first place. Mm, people are getting tired. Let's put Firmino on at Cam for Pastore. And I might bring Origi on soon, although I might make a defensive change to keep stuff uh, solid at the back. Uh, the subscription fee. Uh, where's your username? It moved in the chat. TM. The subscription fee, bro, is four dollars ninety-nine. 
which um, works out as that's weird. I put the <laughs> I put the commands in the chat at the same time that Nightbot was going to auto do it anyway. Uh, the, so it's four dollars ninety nine, which works out about three pound thirty or four euro fifty or something like that. And then uh, because of the software or the company that does like the the middleman between me and Twitch, they add on uh, VAT as well. So it actually works out as almost like four pound twenty or five euro seventy or something like that. Or like six dollars. Can we like stop letting Bournemouth in and around our box? That's run by Yami. I would like a two bell cushion again, if you don't mind, lads, just to give me that peace of mind. Thanks! Starus just goes and scores it immediately. Cheers, pal. Question of offside there, really, but never mind. Uh, I'll tell them to concentrate, and I am going to make a substitution because John Matip is shattered. So we'll take Matip off, put Callum Chambers on at centre back. Oh, that sucks, Lloyd. That's awful. I hate it when, like, you get all excited about a takeover and then the new board, like, are keen to get rid of you. That's the worst. You know what, I might take off, um, as Kyle Walker gets played in down the line, I'll take off look for overlap. Well, that's why Kyle Walker's a right back and not a striker. Uh, your subscription has gone through, Israel Jev, but it hasn't come up on my software. Why is it not? No Why is the notification not gone through? That's weird. There's been two. Um, Gaming X55 has subscribed as well. So uh, Israel and uh, Gaming have subscribed, and it's not triggered the notifications. That might be why yours didn't work, Foxy. Thank you very much to the two of you for subscribing. If you'd like a follow on Twitter, then let me know your Twitter handle is in the chat and I will go over and follow you. Let me update my overlay. To 134. Yeah, it hasn't... For some reason, Twitch Alerts isn't doing the um, notifications. Bear with me. Let me have a look at my Twitch Alert settings because it was playing funny games last night as well, wasn't it? I'll, I'll just check their Twitter quickly to see if they're having issues again. Uh, what am I doing? Sub count. We're updating that. There we go. One, three, four. Uh, yep. Yeah, by all means, put your Twitter handle in the chat. There we go. Let me copy that. I'm trying to copy it, and then the chat keeps moving, so I keep copying like seven people's different messages at the same time. Uh, there we go. Consider yourself followed, or at least a follow request, because you're uh, set to private. Let's advance though, whilst we're doing that. Very well done, lads. Well done. GG. Never mind. Uh, still fourth. Tottenham lost, though. Did they lose? I think they lost. They lost 2-0 at home to Middlesbrough. And Arsenal. Arsenal were already on 20, weren't they? Were they? Arsenal? Yeah, Arsenal were already on 20. And Tottenham, because of the goal difference, have dropped below Arsenal, yeah. I was trying to figure it out. I was trying to figure it out. Your name has a, is Jev. It is a hard G, as in Gaffney. Okay, I will bear that in mind, bro. Israel Jev. Jev. No. Gev? Gaff Gaffney. Gev. Israel Gev. Actually, what was your... Username. Givorgian. Givorgian? I, I apologise, I probably just butchered that, but you know what I mean. Gev. You just got your Twitch alert. Yeah, because that's the thing. Yours went through. So Scrubbington's went through earlier, the resub. So why did why did the other ones not? Hang on. I'm going to check Twitches or Twitch alerts. Twitch alerts. Have they tweeted out again? Because they had issues last night. Let's have a look. Uh, they've not tweeted anything. They've not said anything. 
I might have to... Because if the resub went through, then surely... Surely the new subscriptions should go through. That's so strange. I apologise that it didn't trigger the notification for me to be able to thank you at the time. But at least I've been able to see that they both went through and thank you for subscribing. No, my tweet is out for seven to nine weeks. No, Blaze, no. Uh, it's Phil anyhow. What? Yeah. Um... No comment. Daniel Sturridge was outstanding today. He was good. Blaze Matweedy. You've used just 20 players this season. It's because everybody's been playing incredibly well. Ojo, seven. Got a seven range. Sturridge impresses for Liverpool. Goal and an assist. Thanks, Stodge, mate. Thanks, pal. Twitch alerts to Jason. Well, no, they're normally very, very good. Might not go through on Twitch's end. Yeah, but it, they, I don't know. Because the, the donation came through a moment ago from Foxy, and Sir Scrubbington's resub went through 20 minutes ago. And uh, Gaming Gaming X 55 subscribed nine minutes ago. And Israel Jev, Gev subscribed seven minutes ago. Six minutes ago. So I, d I don't know. Unless, unless Twitch Alerts is having... A, uh, a funny five minutes, literally, then I'm not sure. Uh, I did check my book, Spicy, and they were the right way up. They were already the right way up. Uh, Mikado, no, he's not really going to be good enough, is he? 30 rod right now. We got, we got right back. We already brought Kyle Walker in, didn't we? Yeah, it might just be. Yeah, that's the point. It didn't show up in the. It it didn't show up in the chat. So it might just be Twitch itself. That is an extremely good point. A good point that, as I scrolled up, has been proven to be correct. Look at Ruben being on the ball. It's like, oh, Detective Legend Hood figures out what's going on. So yeah, it'll be it'll be Twitch's end. Well, at least we've at least we've figured that out. Save me sitting here trying to fiddle with settings unnecessarily. Unnecessarily. And he said unnecessarily. Don't even like celery. You want Pastore to score? What in real life or on FM? Presumably, you mean in real life. Because he's, he's, I think, I think he's still on the pitch against. City. It's still nil nil. As things stand, City go through an away goal, so City just need a draw, don't they? Come on, game. Thank you. Messi wins the Ballon d'Or. Shock. Did he win it every other year? Yes. Shock. Uh, World Eleven. Team of the Year was Neuer, Klein, Ramos, Boateng, Bernat. Pogba, Bernardo Silva, Ronaldo, Neymar, Messi, Suarez. Renato Sanchez gets the Golden Boy Award. Ah, oh, Joel Matic gets African Player of the Year. Yes, Matic, congratulations. That's really good. I'm pleased with that. He came third in another African Footballer of the Year award. Um, I don't want a Nazi, thank you. Uh, he came second in Player of the Month. We're not involved in Goal of the Month. We came second personally in Manager of the Month. So if we've beaten West Ham, we might have come top. We might have won Manager of the Month. Never mind. Ah, oh, yes. Director of Football. Oh, hello. Frank Arneson. He looks like he's going to be good. 
12, 13. I'd rather hire someone that isn't currently. Mark Venus. Wow. He was a player at um, Ipswich for years. And then he came to Cambridge. Came to Cambridge for like 18 months. Mark Venus. He had an alcohol problem, I think, Mark Venus. I might be mistaken. Don't quote me on it. But I think he had an alcohol problem and had to like, stop playing for a bit or at least take a back seat. Look down. I'd rather hire someone that isn't currently in another job. I think I'm just going to go with Frank Arneson unless there's anybody else here that leaps out as being incredible. But Arneson seemed to have... Re Glenn Hoddle. Sorry, Glenn. I'm going to go with Arneson, I think. Adaptability 20. He's good at working with youngsters. He's great man management. But when it comes to the thing that you want a director of football to be good at, you want 17 and a half grand? Fucking hell, mate. Right? How about 12? But for five years. 16. He's going to be, to be fair, he's going to be hiring and firing a lot of staff, so might as well pay him what he deserves. See you, Josh. Best of luck with your homework, bro. Uh, oh, changing season expectations. This might free up some extra funds. Uh, transfer rumour is Embolo to Bayern for 36 million ish. Moreno's been flattered by interest from Real Madrid. Is he still wanting to leave, though? That's the thing. One negative. That makes me think, yeah, he wants to move to a bigger club. And we could change. Oh, Jesus, they give me so much more money if I just say Europa League. Oh, bless him. Joel Matip's dedicated the award to me. Oh, Joel. That's so nice. Offers for Moreno. Ugh, I've, I promised him I'd sell him, didn't I? Ah, shit. Um, I want more up front, though. I'm going to want more up front. Um, what's he valued at? He's valued at 15. And they're offering me 14 with only 8.5 up front. Oh, I think I'm going to have to sell him. But I don't want to sell him for that sort of price. I'm going to up this to 20 and suggest... Oh, shit, they accepted it? Fuck. They'll give me 20 million up front, PSG. <laughs> okay, shit. Well, I am definitely going to have to... I'm going to ask for 23 from Real. They'll give me... Oh, shit. They'll give me loads. Uh, okay, hang on. How about... just? I'd rather have it more... I'd rather have it up front. So if I take out that and have just the 4 million up front... Oh, I don't know. No... Just give me the four million up front. Just give me up front, and then you can have him. Right. Because the good thing is that if I go to finances, a hundred percent of transfer revenue, hundred percent of transfer revenue is made available. So we'll get all twenty added to the transfer budget, and and I can go to the inbox now and I uh, say we'll qualify for the Europa League. Confirm. And we'll have loads of money to spend in this window now. Plus I want to sell on Andre Wisdom. Plus I want to sell on Martin Skirtle. We have put more pressure on ourselves by doing that. But we've already reached the expectation for the Capital One Cup. Hoping we can meet, reach the expectation for the FA Cup. Our job is still very secure. Hey everyone. Uh, just got a donation. It's a pound from Assassin Craft. As I says, I hope I'm being lucky again. Can't wait for the new career mode. Yeah, the new career mode will be coming either Thursday or Friday. Probably Friday at this rate. But it, it, it is on the horizon. It will be here before the weekend, so don't worry. Don't you worry. Um, 
So yeah, now we now we have to qualify for the Europa. We don't have to, but we want to qualify for the Europa League to guarantee to guarantee our safety in in uh, the job. It's been a large swell of support. Yeah, good. Uh, Rondon scored three goals in three games against you. Uh, fuck him. Transfer window is open. Uh, yeah, we'll only need the market for the right player. Uh, yeah, I mean, um, tough game first. Not the prepared. Uh, yep. Bournemouth will make Flanagan bid. No, Flanagan's going nowhere. Am I? Am I really chasing Danny Cabellos? I don't think so. I think there's about 17 other positions I'd rather improve in before Cam. Right, well, considering the Everton game is on the second, we'll play that. And then we'll jump in. I just want to get I want to get a positive result in this first leg before we do anything. I just want the peace of mind. Although I've I've no idea what will happen. We will check we will check um pre contracts as well, don't worry. Well we'll do that first after the event game. But we'll check pre contracts, don't worry. It will be done. Uh nil nil. Full confidence, very secure, yay! See, what are they? I just want to see what it's like in everything. Competitions. Uh, pleased with the overall competitions in various. Pleased with the matches we're getting. Club stature, content. Transfers. After canvassing supporter opinions, spoke, supporter of spokesperson Callum Woods feels the, the fans are pleased with the business you're doing. Oh, good. Transfers, same. Oh, it's the one I just looked at. Uh, satisfied with philosophies, finances, board are pleased with your control over wages, squad harmony, content. Well, at the minute, of course, uh, we have a shit ton of wages. City have scored! I just looked up and then looked at the chat. I want to see a replay. It's KDB. I'm glad it was, I'm glad it was Kevin De Bruyne that scored. I like Kevin De Bruyne. When he was at Chelsea, he wasn't good enough. But after a season helping Werder Bremen stay up, and then... Oh, that's a fucking finish as well, I tell you what. First starts to take it past Cavani and then he's bent it in the bottom corner. That's a great goal from Kevin De Bruyne. That's a stunner. Now PSG need two. Well, they needed two anyway, I suppose, because even if they draw level C, you still go through and away goals. Doesn't really change anything. But... Psychologically, it does the damage to... I love the way Pellegrini, Pellegrini, whenever City score a goal, he leans back and he goes, oh. and Roberto Martinez always goes, or like points to the sky. It was like, Mwah. you see different managers have like different celebrations that they always do. Sturridge was in team of the week, so was Yami and Matty. Petter Ankerson could go to Rangers from Red Bulls. Leipzig. Was it Ripple Leipzig? Oh no, Ripple Salzburg. Ooh. Ooh. Blank response to transfer talk. Or Blanc response to transfer talks. Hatchick for Ronaldo. Three nil. Sixteen go. Are you mad? Sixteen goals in his last ten games, Cristiano. And people are all oh, Cristiano's getting too old now. He's getting past it. My ass. Now, it's cup game, so I will play the rotation players. I'm not going to stop playing them, actually. Go Mamadou Saku with Andre Wisdom. 
So let's do around. And then go and trail. Because I've had to play Skirt in the other game, didn't I? Um, this is where Blaze Matweedy's injury really is going to hit us, I think. Chaka and Henderson. Uh, we'll go Ive on the right, Firmino at Cam, and Origi on the left, and Danny Ings up top. I'm not. Oh, I'd. I'm almost. I'd almost rather not. I mean, now we're at the semi-final stage. Might as well go for the win. But I'd almost rather not. Um, go through. So we can concentrate on the league. The league is far more important to us right now, especially since I've upped my expectations. Uh, Sturge and Matip. Uh, PSG got a, Man, Man City got PSG bro. Just being arrested. Uh, trained well and deserves a chance. I will say something about the fans. Yeah, give the fans. In derbies, I always try and revolve the team talks about the fans. It's always important to me to do that. Yeah, you're right. Subscribing to there's so many games in January. It's not even funny. Hopefully, though, the squad can cope with it. Go on, Jordan, destroy him. Oh, how's that for a ball? Arigi! He's offside, shit. I thought we were 1-0 up. I was like, Ugh. no. Uh, I don't. I don't think we'll need to recall Greets, to be honest. I'd rather not, because after the six or seven weeks are up, he's just not going to play again. So it's kind of pointless. Uh, Jordan Pickford's in goal for Everton. That makes my head itch. Sometimes when he's finished that, Danny. How's that for a finish? How was that for a finish for Danny Ings? He's been out for so long. He's been out for so long with an injury, and he comes back and scores a finish like that immediately. On the shoulder of the defender, question of offside, but that is a finish. Danny Ings is back in business. And we 1 0 up. And now we've got a penalty. All the Everton players are like, no, I want the penalty ref. Tough. Who's it going to be to take it? Firmino? Question mark. Danny Ings. To score again. Danny Ings. Oh, he's buried it in the top corner. What a pen. Danny Ings is back. With a bang. Danny Ings, Danny Ings, Danny Danny Ings. He gets the ball, he scores the goal. Danny Danny Ings. Golasso. Oh, don't let Kay Hon through, he's bloody quick. Or let them on the overlap. Never mind, he, could, he shot wide. We're, yeah, we're so lucky we didn't sell Danny Ings. He's been ridiculous this season. Like, look, that's mad. 11, you can't quite see that, I don't think, because of the overlay. Yeah, but he's it says nine in ten in the BPL, but he's actually got eleven in eight starts and three substitute appearances. You can't quite see it because the overlay, unfortunately. It's been so good though. Aesthetically, don't let your performance levels drop. Oh, I'll, I'll tell you that you've been fucking fantastic. Seem confused. Of course he did. Danny Zings 
Ings Esther. Well, puns are out in force now. What? <laughs> As if that's gone in. What was that? I'm sorry, but what was that? Cohen, Cohen Trail has crossed it from basically on the byline. He's taken a deflection off the defender and it's gone in before Pickford's kicked it up. Firmino wants to come off. Oh, God. He's fucked. He's fucked. What even was that? What are those? Get the divot. Never mind. Definitely hacking. Good save, Simon. Oh, Rigi on the counter attack. Never mind. He's just giving it straight to Baruzzi. Make a change. Ah, yeah, we'll put we'll put Callum Chambers there. And we'll play him as a. Actually, no, we'll swap those two around and then we'll play Cam Chambers as a ball winning midfielder. Hey everyone! Le Donation! Uh, it's a pound from Assassin Craft. It says, another goal for Ings if I donate again. We'll have to wait and see. Pastore's played it over the top to Danny Ings, who's on the ball. He's in the box to Origi. Are you lucky? I can't believe that. <laughs> you donate, saying another goal for Ings if I donate again. And it falls to Danny Ings. He was going to get an assist. I thought Origi was going to bury that. But it drops to Danny Ings. He scores, gets a hat trick. As you donated. Assassin Craft underscore one is lucky again. <laughs> To be fair, what? Hold up. It, to be fair, what a fucking finish from Salomon Rondon. How's that for an overhead kick? That's ridiculous. Oh my god, that's one of the best goals I've ever had scored against me. To be fair to uh, Assassin Craft, when you when you subscribed, we scored a goal. When you first donated, we conceded. And then it was your second donation, we scored again. And you became lucky again. And now, obviously, third donation or first donation tonight. No, actually, it's your second donation tonight, isn't it? You donated earlier on. Uh, Danny Ying scored. Danny Mad Ting's Ings. <laughs> oh. That'd be his boxer name, wouldn't it? Don't score again. Don't let him score again. 4-1 would be a great second leg uh, scoreline to go in with. Or five. Or five. Four. Four. <laughs> we'll take four. Four's good enough. Four's all right. That's a good enough result, depending on... Um, I'm just going to passionately say that was ridiculous again. <laughs> Danny Ings with a hat trick. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. He's been out for six weeks. Six weeks with strained knee ligaments. He comes back and scores a hat trick. Injured, 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 and injured, 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 injured. Not selected, not selected, not selected. Hat trick. Uh, no, I don't have a follow link. Plus, you misspelt the word follow as well. <laughs> you, there's only there's two L's in follow, not one. But I don't I don't have a follow command though. No. Because people people can follow just by tapping on their screen, can't they? We just got another donation though. 
Last one tonight, Ings hat trick question mark. Well, he's already <laughs> the goal that he scored last time he donated was his hat trick. But thank you very much for the uh, the donation, Assassin Craft. He can't score now because we're out of the game. <laughs> I just seen you right in the chat. Uh oh, too late. Discontent or your reluctance to play passing football? Have a word. Fourth in the league, and if we win our game in hand, we can go second. And we're in a Capital One Cup semi-final on four up after the first leg, and you're going to have a go at me about not playing enough passing football. That's interesting. Do you rec he reckoned... Really? He reckoned that I should change... Um, Really? I reckon that I should change Flanagan to a player that's no longer needed. Which, considering we might be losing Al Alberto Moreno, he definitely is needed. Right, I'm just going to save the game and uh, have a quick ad break while I go to the toilet. And then we will set about pre-contracts and transfers. BRB. Hello. Hello. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, bum, bum. Right. We will uh contract status expiring. Right, hang on. Let's have a look at this properly.
Uh, I did hear about uh, Mijalovic's sacking today, yes. And what I'll try and do is integrate that into the first episode of the AC Milan career mode. His sacking couldn't have come at a more perfect time. I'm going to try and put together um, a kind of first episode in a similar fashion to the way I did for Forest, where I have kind of like a, a little introduction -y bit, but we'll find out. City have just beaten PSG and knocked him out of the cup, thanks to Kevin De Bruyne. And I've switched to Real Madrid Wolfsburg, and that game is still ongoing, but they are 55 seconds over. There you go. The final whistle has just gone for Madrid as well. Ronaldo, <laughs> Ronaldo's just dropped to his knees and it's like... <sighs> Madrid players are going nuts. <laughs> Ronaldo's lying on the floor. He's just done the... See! That he did at the Ballon d'Or. You know, you know he loves that attention. He loves that attention. Yeah, I don't know why they've sacked Mialovic, to be honest. Like, they're sixth, which is four places higher than where they finished last year. But yeah, Real Madrid and Manchester City are through tonight. Right. Strokeman is available on a fr on a free, but I don't want Strokeman. I don't I don't need any holding midfielders because we have Greach. So I don't need him. Belhanda. I'll get a scout report on Belhanda. I will get a scout report on him. I'm just intrigued by him more so than anything else. Jack Wilshere, I don't want. Plus, I can't sign Jack on a free anyway because we're in the same country. Uh, similarly with Giroud, Bojan, Fernandinho. Sergio Romero is on loan at Bologna, but his contract is running out at Man United, so I won't be able to sign him on a free either unless he moved on. No, yeah, he's still at Man United. Uh, same with Tadic, same with Ospina, same with J. Manuel Thomas. Miranchuk, we could try and sign on a free. And for 16 years, for 16 years old, I was looking at the 16 passing and first touch. For 22 years old, he looks pretty decent. Alexi Miranchuk, I'll get a scout report on him. Uh, Piazza we can't sign, Fazio we can't sign, Gary Medell we could sign on a free, but I'm not really too sure I want Gary Medell. Hey everyone. We got a donation. It's a pound from Israeli Gev. It says, might as well donate when I subscribe. McDonald's finally pay off. <laughs> Love your content, stoked for the new career mode. Thank you very much, bro. Appreciate the donation and the subscription. Very kind of you, and I too, I'm looking forward to doing a new career mode. Uh, Lucas Antonelli. Uh, really neat, no, because we're going to buy a new left back in this window, aren't we now? Uh, Luis Farinha, 26, meh. Hernanes, I do like Hernanes, but at 32, I just don't think he's going to be worth it, unfortunately. I'm probably going to keep Firmino now, because the, the, the only reason we were going to tweet, uh, uh, sell Firmino was to raise cash, but now we don't need to. Uh, I will do subscribe internet, actually, it's a good point. I always forget to tweet, like, every time, almost every time I start streaming and we get halfway through, I'm like, I'll, I'll tweet the stream out now and I'll do this, but I, ne I always get so engrossed in playing the game and talking to you guys that I forget to stream. Me. 
uh, that's weird. I just got, um, I just seen your DM, Luke. That's odd. Let's eat. Uh, anyone else? I and Robin. I and Robin might be available on a free, but there's a hell of a lot of fucking wages there. A hell of a lot of wages. Uh, Asan <laughs> Alessandrini. Me. Just, the chat's just gone. Robin. Bear in mind, it will be the fourth season when he joins us. I've scouted him. It'll be the fourth season when he joins us, and I'm not sure his physicals are going to back him up. We can try. We can inquire. Uh, Cleese is at City, so we won't be able to uh, go for him, unfortunately. Uh, I don't think Semi Kaya is going to be good enough. Sadly, Ashley Young, uh, Bertrand Traore is at Rangers on loan, but obviously he's a Chelsea player, so we can't sign him. Ivan Marcano, I don't think is going to be good enough. Uh, Barada, meh. Uh, Jaime Dominic, goalkeeper. We don't really need a goalkeeper, do we? Where do you want Robin? Where do you want Robin? Maybe. All right. Bottle. Calm down. Uh, Jonathan de Guzman is a, a great player. I really like him, but unfortunately not good enough for us. Harry Winks. Youngster from the Tottenham youth system. Negredo. Don't need a striker, though. Lucas Rupp. Don't need a player in that position either. Aaron Lennon can't sign. Darren Gibson can't sign. Verinia. Ver He's 31 though. Verinia might be decent as a, as a backup player. As a squad player. Although he hasn't really performed at all. Who's he wanted by? Southampton apparently have a minor interest in him. He's not really performed at all throughout this save. Which is a bit disappointing. Uh, can't sign Schweini or Ben Turner. Marcus Urente. 17 passing. I'll get a scout report on you. Um, let's have a look. Shall we spend all right? Rui Fonte. I thought for a minute I said Rui uh, Conte. And I was like, oh. Nobody else really this low down the list is going to be worth having a look at, are they really? Then Claudio Bravo, maybe. But we've got Horn and Minule. We don't need don't need Claudio Bravo. Andre Iniesta. But he's barely playing for Barca. He's doing all right. I'll get a scout report. But it's physicals. I just I like a player that, especially for the Premier League, that is strong. Or stronger and has you know good pace, acceleration, agility, balance. I like I basically I like a full set of physical stats. Jumping reach isn't necessarily too important. Uh, Zlatan is here as well. Yeah, his physicals are worse than Robin's. Sydney Sam. Not, he's just not playing for Schalke. I'll get a scout report on him, but I, I really don't think Sydney Sam will be the one for us. Lou, 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 Lucas Podolski. We looked at Podolski, didn't we? And he turned us... Did Podolski turn us down? I think Podolski turned us down, didn't he? Or asked for astronomical wages. 
I'll get a fresh scout report on him. He'd be a decent backup player. And then, yeah, everybody else is just not really... Oh, Lichsteiner's all right. 33-year-old Stefan Lichsteiner. But we have Kyle Walker and John Flanagan and Callum Chambers. Max Serrano. Mash. Yeah, let's get a report on Mash. Could play him at centre-back, maybe. Stephen Davis, I can't sign. George Thorne, I can't sign. Uh, Roberto sold a 32-year-old Roberto sold I tell you what, he's still banging the goals in, though. Well, he didn't last season, but he is this season for Villarreal. James McLean. Gabby. Wow, 34-year-old Gabby. Gabby. Mr. Love Gabby. Shane Long, Lucas Toro. Lucas Toro? He's incredible in the My Player series that we do on FIFA. He's like 86 rated now. Palombo, wow, as if he's still playing, 36 years old. The Sampdoria hero. He's still playing well as well, actually. Fair play to him. Fair play to him. Daniel Alves. Scout report. Xabi Alonso. Xabi Alonso. Right, let's have a look at transfer listed people now. Transfer estate F. Fabian Delph. Don't need anyone in that position. Goodbye. Daniel Vass. We looked at him in the summer. He chose Chelsea over us. And uh, I'm not sure I want him now. Mkhitaryan. Oh, it's, right, hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Hold the phone. Right, so... I want to move on Martin Skirtle. I want to move on Andre Wisdom. And I want a centre-back. I want a centre-back. I want to sell Andre Wisdom. I want to sell Martin Skirtle. We're going to need a left-back as well. Sergio has been transfer listed by Arsenal. Why? Why in transfer? Why don't you buy him for 12 million and he plays really well and then you just don't play him? Who else have you got? Johnny. I play Aurier over him. I mean, he's playing well. Five, or to be fair, he's in great form. Fair play. He's not even playing Bayerine. If they're not if they're not even playing Bayerin, might try and snap him up. Yep, Brozovic is transfer listed at Chelsea. Suso Right, hang on. Hold up. Position. Left back. Biragi. Don't tell me that's the Biragi we brought in. That might be the same guy. I'm going to see how many of you remember this guy. I'm going to wait for the chat to react. Do you remember Cristiano Baraghi from the FIFA content we put out last year? I'm going to wait and see if anybody remembers him. At left back. Hey, Josh is straight in there. Josh gets 22. The road to glory with Cambridge United last year. Beragi. He was a player and a half. So I will scout him. Luke Garber is available apparently, but it's not exactly on Alberto Moreno's level. I think when it comes to left back, we're just going to have to go out and buy a fucking left back, not someone that's transfer listed. Centre back wise, Adelan Santos. He's not really. I want a. I want a. I want a world class centre back. I want 
you know, someone like a Varane or a Thiago Silva or a Chiellini. Psh, FIFA FM equals life. <laughs> As if John Anthony Brooks is at Real Madrid. What the shit? Well, no, I'm not sure how much money we're going to have left. Skirtle keen to the... Um, Wisdom wants to discuss as well. Yeah, okay, so we now they're on board with being sold. We'll offer Wisdom out for 10... 10? Ten. Ten. Well, for wisdom out for ten, and square all for not much because he's probably not going to be back. Yeah, like one and a half. And then once they're out, offers made five million, five million, five million. Uh, I'm going to reject the one from Bournemouth. Fuck it. Fuck it. I'll just accept it. Clubs join Race for Wisdom. Uh, nope. Uh, nope. Uh, nope. I want your money out front, fam. Yes, there we go. Arneson is signed. New director of football, right then. I'll ask him to recommend me a signing. And staff responsibilities. Get him signing st uh, staff as well. Non coaching staff and coaching staff. And he can hire and fire the chief scout and head of youth development. Actually, maybe not chief scout. There we go. Arneson fails a recommendation. Brilliant. Absolutely fantastic. Right, so let's get rid of transfer listed. Centre-backs in world football. Rafa Varane. Oh. I think the top half of this list is going to be too expensive, considering we're going to need to bring in a left-back as well. Oh, and Eric Laporte is at Man United right now. He's on, He's on £220,000 a week, lads. What the fuck? How can you how can you be on two hundred and twenty thousand pounds a week? Oh, Alaba. Hi, Alaba, you will come play for me, buddy. Oh, okay. We want one hundred and thirty million. I guess you thirty. I guess you thirty. Okay. Emery Chan. Yeah, we do need to pay that if we really want to become top tier, but I don't want to I don't want to lump on someone now when we're not quite there yet. Because if the season trails off in the second half, we're going to be stuck with a player that's a high earner that we don't really need or want. I tell you what, Mark Barcher though. Come play for me, Mark. Oh, okay. Krakowiak, really at centre back? No. Let's look at left back first. Marcelo's valued at 37, 37 million pounds for a fucking left back. Are you mad? Gulan. Oh, Gulan's so good. He really is so good. Right, before we do search you through there, let us let me just have a look at players that you guys are suggesting. Centre-backs and left-backs. Centre-backs and left-backs. Left 
Layoon. Miguel Layoon. Hello. Get scout report. To be fair, Layoon would be sick. I love Miguel Layoon. He's a very good, yes. Rudiger. Antonio. He's at Bayern. Of course he's at Bayern. They just signed him for 12.5 billion at the beginning of the season, but he's not been playing that well. Although, to be fair, he's only started two games, so it's a bit harsh. Uh, um, Bem, uh, Bem is not really of the quality I'm looking for. Villems we will look at. He's at Sporting. Oh. Hang on. I'm going to have to put the room in slow mode. I can't keep up with the chat otherwise. I just typed Kazawa in the chat as well. Squad Kazawa, yes. Hello, Squad Kazawa. Are you a person? Kazawa. Kazawa! Mark Minieza. Is it Palace now? <gasps> Romagnoli. Alessio. Alessio Romagnoli. He's expensive. Wendy? Who's Wendy? Wendy! Wendy, there is nobody called Wendy. Marquinhos. Valued at £28 million. Pounds. Of course. Shadow Keen. Still at Fenerbahce. Fenerbahce. He is good though, Chandler Uh Keely would be too expensive, or not too expensive. What am I talking about? Too old now, I think. Giorgio Chiellini, thirty-three, thirty-three, thirty-three. Thirty thirty He's still playing first team for Juve, so I'll scout him and see what they reckon. Look at that man. First, 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 first. Juve are too good. Ricardo Rodriguez is still at Wolfsburg. He could be a real potential, Ricardo Rodriguez. A real potential. Ginter, Miazga, Fosu, Mensah, Mustafi. Mustafi's a good shell. I'm not sure about Miazga or Fosi Mensa. I could have a look at Ginter though. Mustafi. Yep, that's that's how you spell chess. Well done. Tyus Ginter. I don't know about him. Jose Gaia. Gaia's kind of a, a go to though, isn't he? Oh, Gaia's a bit obvious. He's still at Valencia. As if he's still at Valencia. I'd probably rather, I'd rather um, Ricardo Rodriguez than Gaia, to be honest. Uh, Rigani would be, f oh, I think, Rigani is incredible, but he's going to be so expensive at Juve. He's valued, oh, we're already scouting him, he's valued at 30 million. Jorge from Flemish. Jorge. Is there, have you got any other names? Because there are quite a few Jorge's, to be completely honest. Ah, from Flemish, there we go, this guy. 21-year-old Brazilian. We'll give him a cheeky scout and see if he's any good. Um, Rio, not keen on. Yeah, Flemish is Flamengo. Yeah, they don't have the rights. Same as Gelsenkirchen. Schalke are called Gelsenkirchen rather than Schalke. I'm an Abdenor. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe, baby. Yeah, this is live, Sam. That's what Twitch is. <laughs> Twitch is live. That's how Twitch works. Twitch is a live streaming platform. I just don't think Miathka's going to be good enough. 
I don't think so. Top rack, we could have a look at top rack. Oh, helps if you click in the search box, Jez. Emil the brick. I don't know. I don't know. 13 heading. Doesn't fill me with confidence. Toby Aldevoreld at Tottenham. I'll scout him. If he can do well in the Premier League, then he'll do well for us. Bernard Mendy. Or Benjamin Mendy. Benjamin? Bernard Mendy. Benjamin. Bernard Mendy was the old guy that used to play for Newcastle, wasn't it? Yep. Bernard Mendy. Is it the same Mendy I'm thinking of? Uh, no, used to play for Hull. All right, who's the guy I'm thinking of then? He used to play for Newcastle. I don't know. I don't know. Ah, oh, Jimenez. Yes. Jose Maria. Jose Maria Jimenez could be fantastic. 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 Uh, I don't want Aurier. I want. I need a left back, not a right back. Danny Rose. Mech, 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 mech. I don't know, man. I don't know. I can't. I just. I don't want Kyle Walker and Danny Rose. Nicolas Sola. We could have a look at. He's at Barcelona. Of course he is. He's only played five games from this season. Though Sola could be an option. De Vrij, Stefan De Vrij. Hey Stefan, how are you doing? You alright? Cool, 26 mil. This is expensive, that is. That's expensive. But we're going to need, if we want the best, we're going to have to pay. United just wouldn't sell me Luke Shaw, like, what am I even trying that for? But you never know. Um, I've got Joel Matip already, bro. Godin. Godin, Godin. Godin. I tell you what, Godin, for an experienced experienced head, might be decent. Manlas is at Chelsea, I think, yeah. I don't think you want to join me. Because Chelsea are top of the league, yeah. I don't think you want to join me. Veltman. Joel Veltman. Playing well for Ajax, but I don't know. Ramos would just be too expensive, I think. £250,000 a week. A million pounds a month. Cool. How was my manner? Yeah, I don't know, actually. Where the hell my man my man has my man has been getting on at Southampton. My man How are you doing? We'll get a fresh scout report because this was from the beginning of the season, wasn't it? Oh no. This was the first of January twenty seventeen. Oh it was a year ago. First of January twenty seventeen. Well the year ago. <laughs> Kurt Zuma! Kurt Zuma ain't going to want to join me, though. He's at Chelsea, valued at 30 million. 19 pace? I know I know Zuma's quick, but he's not 19 acceleration, 16 pace quick. Shit. Zuma grows to become one of the best centre-backs in the world. That's mad. I hope he does it in real life. Uh, Balanta is an injury concern, so there's no point signing Balanta. Eric Durham. All right. Have a look at days at Leverkusen. He's just not good enough, I don't think. Soz. I really want Ricardo Rodriguez. Lucas from Atleti. Atleti, 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 Lucas. Get a scout report on him. 21 years old. Bailey, we could have a look at. We'll have a look at Wendell as well. Bailey, he's a what? He's a grower, isn't he? Uh, Wendell, maybe Cousin still.
Play well. I don't want Mangala. Marcelo's valued at 37 million. I would never sign him. Never be able to sign him. I haven't looked at Zivkovic yet, no. To be fair, the guy, the buy Zivkovic guy was here for one night and hasn't been here again since. <laughs> he like turned up for one night, donated about seven times, subscribed, and then hasn't come back. I don't want Baba from Chelsea. I don't know how old Naldo is now. 30, yeah, Naldo's... I'm sorry, I can't. Not with physicals like that. You can't be six foot six and have strength of six. I'm sorry, that doesn't work. Doesn't work for me. Juan Bennett. Of course he's at City. That makes perfect sense. Valued at 36 and a half million. Are you mad? Oh my God. Marcelo's worth 37 million. Hashtag blame Brozovic. Do I watch Geordie Shaw? Uh, no, I do not watch Geordie fucking Shaw. To be fair, I don't watch any TV. Unless it's football or Formula One or... And even, th even TV shows I watch online now, like Flash and Arrow and Game of Thrones and stuff like that. Uh, can I have a look at Congolo? But... Alright, Terence. Scouting, but me. Uh, we've looked at Jimenez. We've looked at Ah oh, Masa. I never know whether it's Masaccio or Masaccio. Masaccio. I don't never know how to pronounce it. Get a scout report there. Federico Federico Barber. Torino. Started off at Empoli. I have never heard of him. Oh, I don't want Fuchs. Jorge Mayer. Nearly. Still at Real Sporting. In Adelante. I think he's going to be good enough. You were watching my stream from yesterday in your math class and got caught. GG. See you, Cam. Bertrand's not good enough. Laporte's at Man United. I'd never, I'd never be able to sign him. Zeka. Uh, if you're on about this guy, then maybe I don't know. I don't know who is Mister Scrubbington. Robert Huth and Wes Morgan. Jonas Hector. He's at Bayern now. Jonas Hector. Super buy, super buy, and hey, hey. Oh, he's not on my save. Fair enough. I must just not have the right uh, leagues on. Uh, Mark Barch, we are in the process of scouting already. I tell you what, Cresswell could be a good sell. But we have to bear in mind, we do have Fabio Cohen Trow as well at the club. Who is also really, really good. Oh, but I would like to sign a f uh, someone. I want Ricardo Rodriguez. A decision made. I want Ricardo Rodriguez. And centre back, we'll have a look at some of the people we've scouted so far. Right, Belhanda. Oh, okay. These are good. these are going to be the free the free transfer guys. Belhanda apparently not worth it. Really? Those oh, I mean his mentals are pretty poor, perhaps, but he looks decent. Miranchuk would probably fail to get a work permit. Oh man. Oh man. They are an affiliated club. Oh, and he's under twenty four as well. Ah shite. Never mind. Robin would be a good signing. I'd be so tempted to sign I am Robin for a little bit. Oh, yes, I would. I am Robin. Do you want to play for me? No, okay. Uh, 
Yes. Uh, please. Robin done will play for me. Never mind. See you, Ian. Toodles. Uh, yeah, Kaya's not good enough. We're really not good enough. Urente. Iniesta would be a good signing. No intention of joining our club on a permanent basis. Is that a surprise? I don't think so. Would you like to play for me, Andres? Oh, how about... Yeah, just not that interested. Oh. Oh. Doesn't have what it takes to qualify. We're in a semi-final right now, you nonce. Ebra, no intention of joining on a permanent basis. All we would... As an under-18s coach? I don't want to sign Ebra as an under-18s coach. I want to sign him as a player. I got all excited for a minute because it brought me to the contract screen and then was like... <laughs> don't tell me he's retiring. Plans to retire. on the, He's retiring at the end of this season. What are his staff attributes then? Where can we... Where can we youngsters? Nine. No... Sorry, Ibra. Oh, that sucks. That sucks. Lichsteiner would be a good signing. I concur. Join me on a free. Come to me. Come to me. Come to me. No, no, Lich Steiner. Uh, mess. Mess. I beat. Mm. 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 I don't really need him for that position because we have great. Battle. Daniel Vich. No intention of joining the club on a permanent basis. Oh, approach to sign. Oh, I don't want to sign for you. Oh, please, please, please sign for me. That would be amazing. We'd love to have you at the club. I'm happy where I am. Please, please, please. I'm not that interested. Okay, bye. Bayerine. Currently has no interest in joining. Ah, go on, mate. Sack off Arsenal. Because they're not playing yet. And come join me instead. Baragi not good enough. This, uh, yeah, me. Doria, no. Rocco, no. Brooks, no. Regani, no interest in joining. Gula, no interest in joining. Layun, maybe. Mm, I'd rather Ricardo Rodriguez, though. I'd add him to the shortlist. Actually, who's on my shortlist? Let's have a look. Shortlist. Uh, oh, Sha, hello. Forgot about you. Get a fresh scout report on Shark. Stevie G, Stuart Long. Stuart Long? Who are you? Oh. Mabes. Uh, emails. Uh, right, Rudiger. No interest in joining. Okay. Just so Willems would be a good signing. Oh, that's pricey though. Damn, it's pricey though. It would be great though. You'd be so good. I love you, Lindsay. You can play for me. No problem. 38 and a half. No. 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 Ah, shit. Because our... Um, doesn't want to join me anyway. Romagnoli, no interest in joining. Marquinhos, no interest in joining. Chanele Keane would be a useful player. Mid... Really? A midfielder? Chiellini, no interest in joining. Rodriguez, no interest in joining. No! Ricardo, I want to sign you so bad. You're, they're 11th in the Bundesliga. 
You wouldn't want to... Oh, come on, mate. Come on, mate. 109 million. Stop twisting my nuts off, Wolfsburg. He's the one that I wanted more than anybody else. Oh, fuck off. Honestly. Dickheads. Dickheads. Mustafi, no interest. Ginter. Some doubts might be worth tracking him. Some doubts. I don't know, man. Gaia. Uh, Miranjuk. It's the only thing. Until we, until we get, until we get, you, until we get YouTube. Oh. Until we get European football, I don't think, I don't think people like that are going to want to sign for us. We're going to have to wait till next season. Which sucks. Santiago Arias. Uh, oh. Do I do I not do I not do I do I do I not? Oh, I want to. Uh. I'll accept him, but I'll just delay it when it comes to the, the deal going through till we've perhaps found a replacement. Uh, don't care. My Serrano's going to Chelsea. All right, Alaba bid rejected. Oh, please. I'll give you 40 million. You want 117. All right, fine, fuck off. March of rejected. He's a re oh, minimum release fee clause of 61. Well, let's be honest, I'm not going to pay 61 million pounds for him, so... Berin, meh. I tell you what, Layoun. I might go back in for Layoun. Not even back in, just go in. Lyon will be able to tide us by until next season when we can bring in a a smashing player. Jorge, see, he does look incredible, but I don't know whether he'd adapt immediately to the Premier League. That's the only problem. I'll add him to the shortlist because he does look really good stat-wise. I just... Ugh, I worry about... I worry about the, his ability to adapt. Top rack, no, out of our world would be a good signing. We're a top mill, they're above us, though, aren't they? Third. Ugh. Mendy. Mm. Mendy. Benjamin Mendy could be quite good. Get a further scout report on him and add him to the shortlist. Jimenez, no interest in joining. Ah, fuck! Fucking shit else. Come and play for me. -na 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 -na. Come and play for me. Please. I said please. Sola. I don't like his mentors, his work rate and stuff. Stefan de Vrij. Have you seen that price tag though? Like estimated cost fifty two to seventy three million pounds for a fucking centre back. Are you mad? Are you mad? You want ninety? Of course you do, of course you want ninety. Piss off. Luke Shaw, no interest in joining. Godin, no interest in shining. Sh shining. No interest in shining. Diego Godin, not at all. Manolas, he's at Chelsea, won't want to join me. Feltman, he's not worthwhile. Sergio Ramos, doesn't have a clue. Mamana.
Zuma, Lucas, Mamana, I just, I like him for potential growth. Bailey, we might just have to, we might just have to wait until the summer till we've got European football because we, we're just not an attractive enough club right now. Does he have a minimum fee release clause? They're looking for a left pack, a goalkeeper, and a central defender. Ooh. I guess Squirtle. As it. <gasps> okay. Banat, no interest in joining. Hummels, no interest in joining. Congolo. Congolo! Meh. Masaccio would be a good sign in. Now that could be one I would def I would that could be one I would definitely go for. Yes. Could be definitely. Don't tend to go together, do they, Chase? But he's a little bit good. Oh, he's got a minimum free release clause of thirty eight. But if I say they suggest he'll go they'll go thirty eight, thirty seven. Okay. Twenty three. Thirty five. Um if I offer them this do they have to accept it? <gasps> yeah, hello, Mateo. You come to me. Yes, we could have movement at centre back. Mateo Mazzaccio. Uh, no interest in joining. Okay. Oh, and Cresswell. Oh, I just don't know. His technicals are so good. He looks like an incredible player. I'm just not sure whether he's good enough. Shah. Royce is at Tottenham. I'd never get him. Oh, sha, 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 sha. Would you be good enough for the Premier League? I don't know. <coughs> Thoughts on Fabian Shaw? Chat. Thoughts on Fabian Shah? I just scouted Miranda. If Masaccio doesn't work out, yeah. Yeah, I can see that long. Ugh. Ugh. <sighs> oh damn. Oh hello. Oh hello. What's he on? 41. I will give you 72, which is twice what almost twice what you're on. You're 130. Sweet. Sweet as a nut, mate. Sweet as a nut. Sweet as a nut, sweet like Tropicana. Hit split like banana. I won't give you 130, I'll give you like 97 though. Why would you think of. Sign it. Sign it, thank you. Right, looks like we're going to be getting Mustachio for centre back. <laughs> Exeter? Moreno's about to go to Pussagur. 
No worries, mate. Wisdom beard. Yeah, but... I want more than that. I want... Six up front. Oh, I reject. <laughs> Beef. Oh. You want to... No, you're not having it for a transfer. Piss off. Moreno's going to go. Bye. Bye. See you. Bye. 30. Oh, no. I want him so bad. I'm not going to be able to afford him. <laughs> Let's get the Masasio deal done, and then we'll look at left back. Darren Way. Okay. I know Wolfsburg don't want to sell him, but I want to buy him. <laughs> That should be enough. I mean, like, oh, I want him, so I should have him. <gasps> Please. <gasps> Please. Jorge. Oh, yeah, Jorge. Oh, vo, 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 vo. We need to learn the language. Spirited individual. Highly ambitious group of players, and he's in a similar mould to the rest of the squad. Athletic, good stamina, natural in a couple of positions. Might be interested in joining. I'm gonna go for this kid then, and we'll start. We'll start Cohen Trail. We'll just start Cohen Trail. It's not as if Cohen Trail's not good enough. And then that kid can grow into our number one. And I'm gonna. Oh, Miranda! Oh, really? He's requested to leave, apparently. I don't know. The £128 million received by Liverpool in transfer fees this season is a new record. See, Albert. I bet the board hate me now for selling Alberto Moreno. They'll be like, oh, we think it was a bad piece of business. No! Piss off, my dude. Right, Jorge's getting exactly what he wants wage wise. Uh, yeah, I knew they'd dis be disappointed in that. Uh, 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 whatever. I'll just give him it because I want to sign him and I don't want Real Madrid to get him. I've seen the time, Josh. Don't worry. Just wait until we get right up until this exit again. You're not having him. He's not for sale. Go away. I don't want Congolo. Oh, here's the exit game. Okay. Will. Le save. It's half past ten. That is going to do us for tonight. We can't do any more transfer business anyway. Because we have the game against Exeter. So we will start tomorrow's stream. With the game against Exeter. And then hopefully bring in Masasio and Jorge. Thank you for all of your help tonight with regards to signings, etc. I would never have found. Never have found or known about that Jorge guy if it weren't for you guys. So thank you very much for that. Also, big thank you to Israel Gev and uh, Assassin Craft for the donations and Foxy and Subscribington for the resub. Israel Gev subscribed as well, as did GamingX55. Uh, so thank you to, you to both of you. Thank you to everybody else that's here. I am going to send you on a raid. I am going to send you on a raid, though. And there's a guy that's streaming right now called JD Gaming JJ9. He tweeted me, ooh, months ago, weeks ago. He tweeted me weeks ago saying that he's doing a charity stream right now. He's doing a 24-hour charity stream and he's streaming uh, Football Manager right now. So go over and give him a big raid because uh, he's doing a 24-hour charity stream. He's got 16 followers, three people viewing right now. Just got, I don't know whether his stream's any good. I'm just going to be honest. But for the support for a charity stream, uh, and he asked me to... Uh, have a look at his stream but since he's playing football manager we'll send you guys there so uh, head on over and uh, give him a cheeky chestnut gaming raid I'm sure we'll really appreciate that so thank you very much for watching guys and uh, I will see you 
tomorrow.